Integers. The upside of negativity, part 3, using chips to show adding different assigned numbers. Negative is the opposite of positive. Sea level is what we call zero elevation. Positive elevation is above sea level. Negative numbers tell us how far below sea level we are. Mount McKinley is a little more than 20,000 feet above sea level. So get some chips. Mine are blue and yellow. The yellow chips represent positive numbers. The blues are negatives. If I add positives to positives, I have more positives. If I add negatives to negatives, I've got more negatives. Positive 6 plus positive 2 is positive 8. Negative 2 plus negative 2 is negative 4. So, here's some, a little quiz to review. You can hit the pause button and write them down, and then check your answers, which are right here. So, nothing's changed. If numbers of the same sign are added together, their values... So, nothing's changed. If numbers of the same sign are added together, their values are added, and the sign stays the same. But what if you're adding numbers with opposite signs? Then the opposite thing happens. Forwards 3, backwards 3, you're back at 0. To add numbers with opposite signs, then do the opposite operation and subtract the values to find the true value of the answer. Negative 3 is the opposite of positive 3, so adding them, putting them together, puts you back at 0. Or on the number line, 3 plus negative 3, back at 0. But hey, let's use those chips. Let's add negative 4 and 4. Negative 4 plus 4 equals, in math language, Here's our negative 4 going in the negative direction. But let's put positive 4. We're back at 0. The positive gives back what the negative number took away. So you're back where you started. So that positive sign means put those together. But if the signs are opposite, you won't have more of the same. So, can you answer this? Why is negative 3 plus negative 3 equal to negative 6? And why is negative 147 plus 147 equal to 0? Let's mix these up. These addition problems make you decide. Same team or different team? Add or subtract? Decide, then do it. Hit that pause button and figure it out. Here are the answers. They're not always evenly matched, though. Imagine those positives and negatives are on opposite teams. When they get together, whoever has more wins. One negative cancels out one positive. Boom! Or, if you're more romantic, the yellow chips are beautiful dancers in long satin dresses. The blue chips are charming partners in blue tuxedos, ready to dance with them. When they're finished pairing off, Who's left? Well, the math we use to answer the question, what's left, is subtraction. That's why, even though there is a plus sign there, we're adding the opposite. It's fighting the first number, so we do the opposite and subtract. So here's what 6 plus 2 looks like. Same sign. They're more the same. Adding them means more of the same. But what happens when we add negative 2? They've come undone. That's right. Time to think differently. Adding positive 2 means I have more. Adding negative 2 means go the opposite way. If I have positive 2, I'll have 2 more. If I had negative 2, I'll have the opposite. 2 less or fewer. In math, 6 plus 2 equals 8. But 6 plus negative 2 equals 4. Here's what 7 plus negative 6 looks like. You still have a positive 1. The positives 1. 
But in some problems, the negative team is bigger. 5 plus negative 6 Oh, we went back further than we went forward. It's got the same value as negative 1. And of course, if you add negatives to negatives, negative 2 plus negative 4 is still negative 6. Now here's a musical version on YouTube for your entertainment. And it's snapshot time. Make a mental snapshot of these. These are from the movie, and they show that when you put together add numbers of different signs, they work against each other. You end up with a smaller value. So, if you're given a problem like 5 plus negative 9, in four steps you can get to the right answer. First step, what is it asking us to do? The plus sign tells us we're supposed to put these two amounts together. Second, are the signs for these numbers the same or different? They are different. So, a little musical interlude to help remember how to add numbers that might be positive or negative. Think of row, row, row your boat and change the words. Same sign, add and keep. Different signs subtract. Keep the sign of the bigger number, then you'll be exact. Same sign, add and keep different sign. You got it. So, back to the problem. The plus sign says we're supposed to put these two together. They're different signs, so we're going to subtract. Now, which value is bigger? Do we gain more or lose more? Which sign will our answer be? We lose more, so it's negative. So, let's put that answer down. 5 plus negative 9. 9 minus 5 is 4. Our sign is negative because we lost more than we gained, so it's negative 4. Now, can you figure these out? You can use the chips, imagine the chips, or follow the steps. Hit the pause button, give it a try. Here are the answers. So, now make up a few yourself. Mix up the order. Have fun. Use the chips and look for patterns. Oh, and that song? Of course it's on YouTube. They sing it a little different. Same sign, keep it a different sign, subtract. You got it. Now, here are some problems that are a little bit more mixed up. Again, hit the pause button, work them out, and those are the answers.